first thing you want to do is open up Business Center. When you open up Business Center, it comes to this screen right here. You got data review, field data, data prep, site takeoff, corridor takeoff, and construction. You're pretty much going to camp out in data review. Whenever you do that, all it does is change your info bars up here at the top. You're going to go File, New Project, U.S. Survey Foot, unless y'all do anything in meters. No, right now it's just feet. We have got a bunch in meters before. Thank God that we're not doing that now. <laughs> All right, and these grid lines right here are on your screen. Sometimes those get in your way. You can turn those off right here. Now you want to bring in the files that you're working with. So if you just drag and drop, left click, drag it across and drop, it imports the first file. You can see right here it created a surface by that little green bar at the top. Looking right here, you can see it's a surface by the triangles. Mm -hmm. Next, bring in your DXF and to send it to machine control, that's all you need. So now just go project, export, And then right here it says Machine Job Site Design Exporter. It falls under this construction tab right here. Model type, choose Surface. Surface is the start northwest ramp. Now you need to add your line work. So what I do is I come here to my View Filter Manager and turn this off. Um, if it's not showing up, you can come right here and turn on your View Filter Manager right there. So turn your surface off, that way you don't grab it in any of your line work. Click right here and just hit Control A. It grabs everything on your screen. Click Add. You see the number of objects added was 39. That's a, a good number. If you start seeing 25, 30,000, you need to clean that line work up. And then you gotta give it a file name and a location. So if you just click the three dots, and I can send it to my C drive, and I'm just going to put it there and kind of call it Start Northwest Ramp. Hit Save. Now, right here, you want to choose what type of machine you have. Um, they have AccuGrade or GCS. They are running it. All right. If, as long as you have a CV460, that's the smaller thumb drive with a USB stick to load it, it doesn't matter which one you choose. If you had an older system, that's where it's a little more crucial. So I'm just going to choose AccuGrade. I'm going to choose, how old is your system? Uh, it's less than a year old. Less than a year. So I know you're going to be somewhere right around 12.4. Uh, you can export 12 and be safe. So I'll just do that just to show. So I'm going to choose version 12. Enable extended coordinate system support. Choose no. And then click export. So now if I come to my computer, I put them on my C drive. You can see right there, it's the Northwest Ramp SVD, Northwest Ramp SVL.